This woman loves breaking down barriers and smashing records. People are choosing hope over fear and uh, unity over division. And it's a really exciting opportunity. She is 37-year-old Ilan Omar, a Somali-American who's gone from one of the world's biggest refugee camps to the US Congress. She was elected with nearly 80% of the vote in Minnesota, which has the highest concentration of Somali immigrants in the country. Her election is especially huge news because most Somali citizens are still banned from even traveling to America. President Trump says it's to keep the country safe, but many people say it's discriminatory. No fear. Minnesota, it's a cold state, but the people have warm hearts and we don't just welcome immigrants, but we send them to Washington. And not only is she the first Somali American to be voted into Congress, she's also one of only two Muslim women elected and she'll be the first Congresswoman to wear a headscarf. So how has her election gone down with people in Somalia? I'm very pleased with the victory of that Somali Muslim woman who got 80% in the US midterm elections. And that victory is for all Somalis. It shows that Somali women can achieve tremendous success. I couldn't sit on the sidelines and not be part of a group of people who were insisting on a set of values that got us closer to the America we know we can have and the America we know we deserve.